Hello everyone. I just joined this game of trading, not trading, bruh. I'm used to being in trading, but no. We're in casual again. And you know what? I want to talk about like a topic that really affects me about counter blocks. And it's stuff that's not in trading. I'm going to talk about stuff that's not in trading now. There's probably a bunch of items that aren't in trading, but I'm going to talk about the stuff that affects me. So the stuff I have that's not in trading. And you're actually looking at it right now, the Huntsman Aurora. This thing is not in trading at all. Like, bruh. It's a, in my opinion, it's one of the best looking knives in the game. It's beautiful. And like, it looks nothing, it looks like nothing else from any of the other cases, bro. It's like very unique, I love it. And it's not in cases of, I mean, not in trading, of course, right? But if it were in trading, I, I assure you, it'd be worth a fortune. Come on, teammate, peek, peek, peek. Oh, okay, never mind. Okay, cool. But yeah, I'd imagine that if the Huntsman Aurora, this knife was in trading, it'd be worth a fortune. Just because of like, it wasn't in a New Year's case. By the way. Oh man, bro. That scared me. But yeah, it was in the New Year's case at the beginning of 2020. So I guess, uh, 2020 New Year's case? I guess that's what it's called, right? <laughs> but yeah, at the beginning of 2020, like, they or yeah, December, January 1st, 2020, I believe that was the day that they released this case, like at midnight or something. So I opened some, and this is one of the knives I got. Also got the bayonet wrapped and Balchin wrap. Those are both extremely ugly. The bayonet wrap is probably the ugliest knife in the game. Not even a joke. Although it's pretty glossy, but that doesn't make up for its ugliness. It's actually unbearably ugly. Okay. Teammate, I'm, I'm just hoping for my teammate to push for that. Okay. Caught it. But yeah. <laughs> okay, I'll show it to you. Screw it. Let's show it to you. It's not in trading, but it's ugly. Look, this thing is ugly, right? And I'm pretty sure Xenu said something about not adding the... What do you call it? The nearest case knives into trading because they're too ugly. Now I'm too lazy to search for it, but you're gonna have to trust. You're gonna have to trust me when I say that. <laughs> I, I'm assuming he was just joking, but you never know. You never know, bro. <laughs> what if Zeno was being serious? Because th these are kind of ugly. This one's probably the ugliest one I own. And I own some like I mean to be fair, like stuff like Geoblade is just trash value. It's not ugly. Like Geo, in my opinion, Geoblade is like beautiful. It's just not worth anything. <laughs> Alright, and did I mention that this was also not in trade? I feel like I forgot to mention that. I was too busy talking about something else. And in case I was, yeah, this AUG is also not in trade. They're both from the... If I remember correctly... If I remember correctly, it was from the, de uh, the December case. It was either called the December or the Christmas case. It was either one. I'm pretty sure it was the Christmas case, though. So. Actually, no. I don't remember, bro. Does it look like I remember? It was either called the Christmas case or the December case, and none of those items from that case are in trading. Plus, none of the items from the New Year's case, right? I'm pretty sure they uh, deserve to be in trading. I mean, come on. <laughs> I mean, I thought Xenu or whoever. Xenu Scout, I'm not sure who adds it into trading. I forgot, but either one of them. I thought they would have like pushed to add them. I mean, they added the Hex Gloves after Halloween of like 20 after halloween 2020 they put the hex gloves in trading and the last time the hex gloves were in trading were in 2019 so i mean obviously they they were looking into adding stuff the old stuff into trading oh. i'm hoping my teammate okay good oh whoa good job good job oh that was me patting myself on the back <laughs> Okay, that's my teammate. Why am I playing so good right now? I was playing earlier on stream and I was playing like garbage. Garbage. Like I could not play for the life of me. I kept dying. Although I won a few games, but that was mostly from like a carry. So, yeah. Alright, let's peek. Okay. Good timing, good timing. Um, And let's show off the Falchion Wrap. Actually, in my opinion, the Falchion Wrap doesn't look that bad. It's just a meh tier knife. 
I see like Geoblade doesn't look that bad compared to this. I'd rather take Geoblade. Although, how much do you think this would be worth? This is a blue. What would the value of this be, right? I think earlier in the video I mentioned something about like saying the Huntsman Knight would probably be worth a lot if we're in trading. But I wonder how much stuff like this would be worth, right? Since I don't think like the night, uh, the New Year's Knight case was open a lot. I might, well, I'm a, that's just an opinion. I don't even know. I can't see the numbers, so I won't even know the exact numbers. But I never see anyone with New Year's knives. I see like once in a blue moon. All right, let's switch back to Huntsman Aurora. If I can find it in time, panic. <laughs> but yeah, there's also a butterfly Aurora, and I think the red from the case is called like the festive. In my opinion, the game, if they ever do more cases, they should do, they should focus more on gun skins instead of knife skins. We've had only good, good, good collab. <laughs> we both tagged them. They should focus more on gun skins, not uh, knife skins, right? It's kind, knife skins are kind of getting old, and if you notice, every single gun skin that they release is like super expensive. That's like a red rarity, right? They should release a case like the Independence case, just drop one randomly, just on a random day. You know, like Valentine's Day. What well, if they just drop a Valentine's Day knife case? Or not even a knife case, just a case with a bunch of skins. That would be absurd. Dang it. Right? And that would be worth a lot. Oh. Dang. Yo, my aim. I'm like hitting their heads. I mean, I'm not not their heads. Of course not. I'm not even hitting. I'm not even killing them. I'm hitting their toes, bro. What do you guys think about this skin? Retroactive is probably one of my favorite skins. Retroactive and Outrun, they're both fire. This one is the only skin that has stickers as far as I know. Look at that car, bro. Fire. Very detailed. That's why I said they should add more gun skins. They should stop focusing on knives and try doing gun skins. Although, I'm not sure if knife or guns are harder. Maybe guns are harder because they take up more space. I have no idea. I'm not a skin designer. But if they were to design skins, I would prefer gun skins, right? We haven't seen any new gun skins. When's the last time we got a new gun skin? We got a Halloween case, though. Yeah, we got a Halloween case, but I mean, I mean like a red gun skin, like a red rarity or higher gun skin. Or like, no, we've had red rarity gun skins in the last update, didn't we? Why can't I recall which one it was? Which one was it? Oh, right, it was the Mystique and the Dropout, okay. Yeah, that, that's why I didn't remember, I, think, I didn't really like them. <laughs> I never use them. I maybe use them for like a tiny bit, but right, but they were never put in my daily routine of knives and skins so i'm gonna drop out knife i unboxed three dropout knives from the halloween cases and i didn't use them like ever actually i used them at first and then i traded them all away from like mean greens and stuff okay oh i could have killed that guy maybe i'm not really okay we got we got him we're doing good. I don't know if they're ever updating the game. They might be. I mean, I saw on the game page it says like last update updated three days ago. So I mean, obviously there wasn't a content update three days ago. So they're either doing stuff behind the scenes, like bug fixes, or they're actually like adding content and like doing stuff. I have no idea. I don't know. I don't know their plans, right? They said that would be the last update, the, the Halloween update would be the last update, but they still did the Christmas update. So, you know. And they did do a Christmas case after they said they wouldn't be a Halloween case. I mean, they still did a Christmas case after they said there wouldn't be one, so. Yeah, I actually really wasn't expecting a Christmas case, I'm gonna be honest. Like, that actually shocked me when it came out. I 100% believe there was no more cases, like CB was done, I was like, okay, whatever. I fully accepted that fact, and then they dropped the case, which is absurd. But I didn't open any, because I didn't think it was a good value. I was like, eh, they're not going to be worth anything, it's not worth it. Right, and look at them now, <laughs> they're not worth anything, I think. Right, I'm not sure how much they're worth, to be honest, and I don't even want to bother trading for them ever, so. Yeah, that's it. But yo, that's this video. Hopefully. I addressed everything I wanted to talk about, but yo, yeah, I just wanted to talk about why, no, I, not why, but like what skins are in trading and what oh, I hope that they get added, you know, hopefully. That's like the last thing I would want in the game, to be honest. I don't really care about more skins, although it would be nice 
if they did work on more skins and maps and stuff. I mean, they added season, but yo, I have no idea. Well, welcome, or not welcome, <laughs> welcome to the end of the video, right? Uh uh, it's like that, but yo, this is the end of the video now, so yo, make sure you like, sub, and peace, yo. Peace.